And? About even. I'm worried. Oh, it was too easy. <laughs> Something's wrong. <laughs> what did we do wrong? What did we do wrong? It worked out. It worked out. Now we're trying to determine how big the doorway. How big to make it? Yeah. Where do you want to? You want to stand back and look at it? Do yeah. the ten foot test. Yeah. Ooh. <clears throat> I think that's how big we should make the door. I think that's a good idea. Because then, if you had bigger stuff to wheel in there, you could. inch door would be good. Yeah. I can't remember what that lawn tractor is. Let's put it puts it in the center. Right. So you want to center the door or leave it to the right? Well, that's not good. Ooh, a nail or something. Something. Did you wreck the blade? No. Oh. It's just jamming, I guess. Hmm? No problem. Right. It just clicks in like that? Yeah. Mm. So which one do you want for over there? This one will go over there, I guess. Okay, and this, this is... one goes over there. Okay. Yeah, I like that idea that the door centered. Yeah, I think that's I think a better it, idea. Yeah, I think it is. Thank you. I mean, what's a new bit cost? Not much. So it's really kind of yeah. buy a new bit for a couple of bucks. That's right.
Need me to hold that? Is that still going to be a 40 inch door? Well, it should be. Yeah. It's 49 inches now and you'll take a double header, so you take 3 inches off each side, so 46, 7, 8, leave a 41 inches. So that's, that's a good size door. So I think that'll, that'll work. Yeah, well, that that's the thing, because, I mean, uh, a house door is, what, 36 inches? Yeah. Yeah. You happy with that? Good start. Now, why are you putting this in there? Well, just to keep everything in line. So it's temporary. Yeah, it's just a temporary piece. I might, I might just cut them out later. It's good that you put that board in then because that's now your whole building is square. Yeah. So 143 and three quarters. <laughs> and the eighth of an inch is with intolerance, so. All right, I think what we're going to do to save cutting pellets, to save pellets, we're going to put a top plate here. And then... Or a mid plate, I guess. Mid plate, yeah, mid plate, I guess we're going to call it. So we'll put all around, we'll bridge all these gaps, tie them all together, and then we'll take the pellet, and then we'll put the pellets 
a double row. On top of the two by fours. Yeah, it's not ideal to have the joints set up, but we we put we put some really good reinforcing here in the middle. Yeah, you got two by fours in there. Plus, we're going to have uh, uh, beams to tie in, and it's only an eight by eight shed. I mean, it's not. If we were building a twelve or a sixteen foot building, I would probably not do that. But I think I think we got enough of these two by fours that we can get away with that. So I think that's what we're going to do. We started defeating our purpose, and we're starting to cut the oh, let's see guys. Let's see what we got. square this wall up too. Mm -hmm. All right, we have, we have a plan. A plan. It's only 15% of a plan. But well, it's, it's plan. better than 14%. Yeah, if you overlap the the pal this stands here, yeah. Well, we want to we want to we want to have it the same on both sides, right? And there's a joint there. We want to flush on the outside. That's important. The inside's not so important because I'm not doing anything with the inside. I want the outside flush. So the outside boards flush with the yeah, because we're going to put lower boards, there, right? So upper and lower flush, okay. Yeah, so upper and lower, because these pellets aren't as thick as these pellets. I put the heaviest ones below, and then we put the lighter ones up higher. Oh, that's a good idea. We should have mentioned that earlier on, I guess. Okay. Holy crap. I'm just gonna start this now. Thank you. 
doing here? What are we doing here? That's pretty much perfect right there. Hold on right there. Okay, so, what do we need? You got that? Yes, I do. It's a little late now to ask. Yeah. Let me start one of Yep, I can hand you the level. That's not a problem. I'm just going to put a brace in here temporarily so we can uh, so we can uh, get that back wall straight up and down. Right. So push, push my way just a little bit. Push whoop, back towards the edge right, right there. And run the screws. Of course. I know. I saw that earlier. You're bleeding again. You bleed me working. Okay. It's amazing how I can like, you know, work all day in the house and not be bleeding. I know baking can be just as good as. Well, it is. Making bread is hard. It's okay. Looks straight. That's okay. Get you to do go on the inside there again and make sure that the outside boards are flush up and down. Okay. And I can get a couple of screws in here. Just on this end here in the in the center. Does it look alright? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they're flush. Okay.
this side. Yep, and they're good. So, uh, like I say, we want it. We want it just uh, true here. So, the, in it, but to get it plumb when we put this one in, then we'll plumb it up like we did on the other side. Oh, okay. Board. Like I, I don't want to use a, the nice wood pellets in the wall. Like when you got wide boards like that, it, it's nice to keep them for other things. You know? Okay. So you were looking at how big the two by fours were. Yeah, and and these and these here too. But they're not a useful board. Like when you cut that board off, or you cut this pellet in half, mm -hmm. it's not a useful board. You really can't even build. But the wider ones, they're a lot better to build with. Okay, these ones here. Yeah. Yeah. Well, if you like, you get the wide boards like that, nice clean wide boards. Yep. You can build stuff with them. Right. But these old, and then these these boards are too thin. Mm -hmm. You know. They're and they're already more, split and everything it's, from it's the nails. It's almost firewood. Is what they yeah. Are, okay. You know. So we went through what six pals for you to find a good one yeah well it's not even the best one but... no i know there's some breaks and things in it but we'll have to fix that later but are yep. we yeah. the level please yep What's wrong with it? Yeah. Well, I see this. There's a yeah. three eighths of an inch gap here. Yeah. yeah. I want to get away with it. The problem is the pellet's not square, right? No, it's not. 